Hi folks, and thank you for joining me for another episode of my easy, delicious meals at home. You can adjust the ingredients for two or three servings. You only need what you see on the screen for this recipe. To enhance the texture of your baguette, you can lightly moisten the surface with some water before baking. This will create steam in the oven and result in a crispy and golden crust. Make sure you don't use too much water, or you will end up with soggy bread. To bake your baguette, you will need an air fryer with a bake roast function. Adjust the temperature to 180 Celsius and the time to 11 minutes. Then, lower the lid and press the start button. Your baguette will be ready in no time at all. To prepare the onions, you will need to remove the outer skin and the root ends of two medium-sized onions. Then, cut them in half and lay them flat on a cutting board. Using a sharp knife, make even slices along the length of each half, about a quarter inch or six millimeters thick. You should end up with thin strips of onion that are suitable for sauté or frying. You can enjoy a delicious and crispy baguette that was home-baked in just 11 minutes. All you need is an air fryer and some simple ingredients. Once the timer goes off, carefully remove the baguette from the air fryer and transfer it to a cooling rack. Let it cool slightly before slicing and serving. You will love the baked crunchy crust and soft interior. To prepare the onions for the Ninja Speedy, you need to adjust the settings of the appliance first. Select the sear and saute function, and then press the temperature button until it shows high. This will heat up the cooking pot quickly and evenly. Next, measure 3 quarters of a tablespoon of vegetable oil and pour it into the pot. Wait for a few seconds until the oil is hot and shimmering, and then add the onions. Stir them occasionally to prevent them from burning or sticking to the bottom of the pot. To achieve a rich and flavorful base for your dish, you need to let the onions cook until they are golden and caramelized. This process can take some time, but it is worth the effort. To start, heat some oil in the pot over high heat and add the chopped onions. Sprinkle some salt and black pepper over them and stir to coat. Let the onions sizzle and fry in the oil, stirring occasionally to prevent them from burning. You will notice that they will gradually soften and turn translucent, then brown and sweet. This can take anywhere from 10 to 15 minutes, depending on the amount and type of onions you are using. Yeah, they're pretty much ready now. That's, that's 11 minutes in total. So all we're going to do is pop these to one side to finish. We'll just add our sausages. We're going to close the lid. And we're going to turn the temperature down to number three. At least, you know, for the first five minutes. Oh, yes. Give the onions a bit of a stir. Keep on cooking. Yeah, that's looking good. That's looking good. We'll close the lid for another uh, another five minutes. See how we do from there. Uh, we're coming up on ten minutes. There's plenty of steam rising, so we're not burning. So let's have a look. See what we're doing. Good. That's very good. Onions are looking good. Right. Okay. Let's try a temperature test. Get the thickest one so we can see it. That's, a, that's 130. 130, right. Okay, that needs probably another five minutes. And we 
we'll check the temperature from there. Right folks, we're at the um, 15 minute mark and we'll see how we're doing. Now it's looking better, that's 100, oh, that's 150 there, 158, 160, oh these are done, oh yes. off. We need some mayonnaise. Lovely. Fresh bread roll or baguette. Very very mad at mayonnaise. This is the hot one. It does go well. It does go well with sausages and onions. Let's get a bed of, bed of onions first. Yeah. Who doesn't like fried onions? Right. Absolutely cooked all the way through. Now pack our baguette. really nice. The onions are cooked to perfection, the sausages are absolutely succulent, they are tasty, the piri piri mayonnaise just lifts the whole, um, the whole baguette, it really is nice. This is my tea folks, it's, that is lovely. I don't know what else to say. I'm going to thoroughly enjoy this tonight. Thanks for watching folks and I'll see you in the next video.